of our message on last Sunday. I want to talk about the great shepherd, the great shepherd. Uh, from the 20. Third Psalm that says, The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want, and he maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He leadeth me beside the still waters. He restoreth my soul. He leadeth me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk, through the valley of the shadow of death, I shall, will feel no evil, for thou art with me. Thou rod and thou staff, they comfort me. Thou prepare the table before me in the presence of mine enemies. Thou anointest my head with oil, my cup runneth over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. <clears throat> On last Sunday, I introduced this psalm to you. Uh, because it is very important to know the setting of this psalm. Many theologians have agreed that this psalm is written by David at a time when he uh, was attending his father's sheep. Or it was written at a time when he was running and hiding from King Saul. But however, and whatever occasion it was, David uh, penned this song by saying, the Lord is my shepherd. We do recall that uh, David, when he was attending his father's sheep uh, at some point in time in his overwatch of the sheep, uh, came in contact with some great danger. As we shared with you on last Sunday, that there was a time uh, he was attacked and the sheep were attacked by a lion. And David, with his bare hand, as a shepherd boy, killed the lion. And on another occasion, as he attended his father's sheep, uh, a bear came out of the woods and attacked the sheep and with his bare hand he killed the bear. So when he penned this psalm, it, it could be from those two occasions or it could be from the occasion where he was hiding from Saul. But he gives God credit here. He says, though my hands kill the bear and kill the lion, but the strength of my hands was under another shepherd. The strength of my hands was under another shepherd because ordinary strength could not have killed the lion 
ordinary strength could not have killed the bear. So, so David said, the Lord is my shepherd present tense. Not that he was my shepherd. He said, the Lord right now is my shepherd. And I shall not want, not yesterday, I shall not want now. Because he is my shepherd. He is my shepherd. And I shared with you on, on last Sunday, sometimes uh, uh, when you're in your strength, you can't do nothing. When the bears come upon you, and, and somebody know what I'm talking about, you know, you've been under bear attack. Do I have anybody here who's been under bear attack, who's been under line attack from from friends and from enemies, from kinfolk and from employers, employees. You've been under attack. And in your own strength, you couldn't defend yourself. But strength came from somewhere. And strength came somehow. Do I have anybody here know that it wasn't in your strength that you took care of your bear? It wasn't in your strength that you took care of your line. It wasn't it in your strength that you took care of your enemy, but from somewhere, strength came. And so David said, the Lord is my shepherd. He's my shepherd right now. Anybody know he's right now? He's my shepherd right now. now. Not yesterday, not last year, not tomorrow, but he's my shepherd right now. And not only is he my shepherd right now, but he leadeth me. Huh? Oh, yes, sir, yes, sir. He leadeth me in green pastures. Do I have a witness in here? He leadeth me in green pastures. Not yesterday. How many know he leads you right now? Do I have a witness in here? He leads you right now in green pastures, which means he leads you right now in the way of prosperity. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 not tomorrow. Not yesterday, but he leads you today. In the way of pros, oh, you don't hear, you don't, you don't, you, 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 you don't hear me. He gives me prosperity today, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And 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 then then you know where he gives you prosperity, even in the presence of your enemies, he helps you to be prosperous. Not tomorrow, but right. Right now, in the presence of <laughs> of your enemies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and not only he makes you prosperous in the presence of your enemies, but he prepares a table before you in the presence of your enemy. And they can't do a thing about it. How many know your enemies can't do a thing about it? A table that the Lord prepares for you in the presence of your, your enemies. They can't do a thing about it. right now. Right now, some of you eating in the presence of your enemies. They don't want to see you eat. They try to stop you from eating. But right now, in the presence of your enemy, you are feasting on the Lord. And your enemy can do nothing about it. Yeah, they jealous of how you're eating. They jealous of how you're prospering. They jealous of your seat at the table. They wish they could be at the table, but God got you a seat at the table in their presence. Oh, they try to vote you out. They try to run you out. They try to frighten you out, but God keeps you right there.
Somebody in here been there. Somebody there now. Somebody there was yesterday. Somebody know that nobody can take your seat because God put you in that seat. At the table. Anybody in a godless seat that God put you in? Anybody in a seat that your enemies didn't want you to have it? But God put you in that seat right in their presence? Woo! Yeah. I've been there. I know what he can do. Yeah, can't nobody take what God has given you. If it's for you, it's for, come on and help me to say it. Say, if it's for me, it's for, if it's for me, it's for, God gave it to me. Sometimes, even though God puts you in the seat, but sometimes your enemies wear on you and try to wear you down. Can I get a witness in here? You got the seat, but they try to make it hard for you. Oh, do I have my crowd in here? You in the seat, but they try to make it tough for you, criticizing you, lying on you, bike biting you. Digging ditches for you. They try to make it hard for you in the seat. But look around and tell them, God replenishes me. When you wear me out, he restores me. He gives me new strength. He gives me new life. You train me with your lies. You train me sometimes with your backbiting. You train me by putting extra burdens on my shoulders. But when I look around, God picks me. He picks me up. He replenishes me. And, I, and sometimes I tell my enemies, when I know the Lord to replenish me, he said, I tell them, go ahead on and do what you want to do. Give me your best shot because I fear no evil. For the Lord is with me. I don't fear you. Huh? He put me in the seat. He prepares a table before me. Give me your best shot because I feel no, no evil. For the Lord is with me. Uh, he is the great shepherd, I tell you. Anybody know he's the great shepherd? Can't nobody beat God doing what he's done. Can't nobody beat him doing the way he does it. Can't nobody beat him doing what he does. He is the great shepherd. Yeah. Uh, every day. I feel like preaching a little bit. I know I got a meeting after service, but I feel, I feel a little preaching coming on. 
You know what I tell my enemy? I tell my enemy, I tell my enemy, listen here, listen here, listen. Here. I got God's security every day. Every day he is with me. Every day he restores me. Every day I can walk through the valleys of the shadows of death. Every day I eat in green pastures. Every day I sit at a table in front of my enemy. Every day he is my shepherd. Every day. He's my shepherd. Oh, I wish I had some Holy Ghost folk in here. I wish I had some folk in here that know they how, how to trust the Lord and, and how to know that he is your shepherd. I wish I had some folk in here that can tell the world, he is my shepherd. I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He leadeth me beside still water. It didn't say run in water. Can't nobody wait, make water still but God. I wish I had somebody. Huh? When you're thirsty and need to drink, can't nobody make your water still but God. Yeah, when the water running, God can make it still. And when your enemies don't want to see you drink, you can drink. When they rougher the water, when they stir the water, when they muddy the water, God can make it. And in the presence of your enemies, you can drink still water. He is my shepherd. Not only is he my shepherd, but he's my great shepherd. Do I have a witness in here? He can do anything but fail. Do I have one witness to know that failure may be in you, but there is no failure in God? Do I have a witness? Won't he take care of you even in the presence of your enemies when they try and to cut your throat and they try and uh, to dag you in the back all you have to do is look around and say I'm secured in the presence of you because my God that I serve is an able God the God that I serve is a right now God the God I serve is an all powerful God he knows how to protect me he knows how to feed me he knows how to work with me me. He knows how to cover me. He knows how to walk beside me. He knows how to talk with me. He knows how to dry my eyes. He knows how to hold my hand. He is my God. He is my God. Somebody here ought to say yes. Is it all right? Is it all right? All right. All right. All right. He's all right. He's all right. 
faith. Ah! You are all right. Somebody say yes. You are all right. Ah, yes.